Okay, just a test. Can you guys hear me or not? Okay. We good? All right, are we good? Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There. There, 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 there. All right, all right, cool. All right. I am going to do like a quick little disclaimer, bro, because today we are going to be doing something that is a little bit more intense for people that probably haven't did breath work before. So if if you're not willing willing and ready to go a little bit in more intense than we usually go then today would be the day i'd be like okay this would be a video for this going to be a recommended class for later on in your breath work journey um but today we're going to be really focusing on our neck and since we text a lot a lot of text neck and stuff so i'm going to be we're going to be i'm going to be teaching breath work that reverses your text neck and help stimulate that the neck muscles and those dormant those dormant spinal fluids that haven't really got to shoot up to your brain as they're supposed to because most of the time we got text neck like a hump in the back of our neck you know and um andy you can start recording now bro actually okay you are recording good all right um so right now if this is a this quick disclaimer if if you're not ready to go a little bit more intense today i understand that that's okay all right so yeah this is the quick disclaimer if you're not ready to go a little bit more intense a little bit more deeper in this breath work session and it might bring up a little bit of trauma or pain within your spine and your neck that you might have to deal with you know so and we are gonna alleviate a lot of tension and we might make aware of more things you need to work on within your temple. So I'm just let, I'm just letting everyone be aware of this right now. So you don't come to me like, yo, I did the breath work. Now I had I had to start moving my neck a certain way, you know? I'm just making you aware right now. Today we're gonna to be going a little bit deeper within um our tensions and our emotional tensions that we could be harboring within our neck and Cause your neck is as above so below. So your neck is like a powerful foundation. It's like everyone has their own sexual organs. Your neck is basically like your upper sexual organ. If you think about it, because as above, so below your brain, your second brain and your third brain would be your sexual organ. Your second brain would be your gut and your third brain would be right here, you know? And we have a lot of tension in the back of our neck. Just FYI. So right now we're gonna be doing we're gonna be doing a couple exercises to stimulate our spine. And then we're gonna be stimulating our neck. So first things first is find a meditation posture, lotus or just regular cross leg. I'm in regular cross legged cross. All right. Everyone that's ready, let's let's do it together, fam. All right. <clears throat> All right. So what we're gonna do is a cat cow. So we did this last class. Continue with doing the cat cows. We're gonna be using our nose and we're gonna be inhaling. Opening your chest up, opening your heart center, exhaling, rounding your chest. So let's do this together, guys. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. It's good to grab your shins or your knees. Inhale, exhale. 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 Inhale, exhale, open your heart, open your spine. Inhale, open that chest up, open that spine up. 
Exhale, round your back. Tuck your chin. Inhale, open up. Neck up, chest out. Exhale, round your back, tuck your chin. Ah, we want to pick up the pace a little bit, guys. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Take a deep breath in and hold it. And three, two, one. Exhale. Hold your breath, nowhere needed. If you feel your body temperature changing, if you feel a tingling sensation, that's okay. You're in a safe space now. In three, two, one, recovery breath in. Return to your normal breathing. Oh, you only can see part of me? All right. Is this good? Is this better? Nope. Never mind. Put it, put it back. Okay. <laughs> All right. This is good enough? Like, can you, can you see, like, this part of my face or this part? I mean, we're going to have to edit this out, Andy, so my bad. Like, you only can see, like, the top of my head. Like, you can't see my legs. Oh, yeah, you're going to have to. All right, lips from the bottom of the shirt. All right, from my screen, I kind of, like, made it to the point where I can see my full body. like my legs and everything. You might have to like tap my screen so it can like enlarge. Yeah, Jane said double tap his video and they expand. You can see, yeah, she can see all. So you might have to double tap my screen if you're on PC or on the phone. All right, let me know if the ch something changes, Andy. Is there any way you can expand it? All right. Okay, that's, yeah, see, Jane got, yeah, Jane got what, the same thing I'm seeing, too. Is that better, Andy? I gotta go like this, a little bit higher. Maybe you can, um, I mean, I don't know if you can double tap on the thing, but I just double tapped it on my phone and I can like see my self now. Hopefully it does. Yeah, it doesn't work on PC. All right. So that that's fine. That's fine. Um, well, I guess we, I can just probably, we don't probably have to have this class. From it in a flashback, then. Um, all right. So now that our spine is all lubricated and stuff, we're going to do some neck rolls. So we're going to roll out our necks. And for this, we're going to be inhaling up, exhaling down. So on the inhale, your, your, your head's going to be rising, 
Your head is going to be rising. On the exhale, your, your head's going to be tucked. We're going to do that about 15 times one way, and then we're going to go 15 times the other way, and then we're going to do a breath hold. So let's begin. In three, two, one. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Two. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. No pauses between your breaths. Inhale, exhale. Keep it circular. You can go slower if you feel nooks and crannies. Nooks and pain. Go slower. Feel that pain and relieve it with each and every breath. Inhale. Rise. Exhale. Keep going. Inhale. Exhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Last three. Inhale. Exhale. Two. Inhale. Exhale. One. Inhale. Exhale. Now switch sides. Inhale. Two. One. Inhale. Exhale. Two. Inhale. Exhale. Three. Inhale. Exhale. Four. Inhale, exhale, five. Inhale, exhale, six. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Last five. One. Two, inhale, and three, four, five. Straighten up your spine, fully in. Hold, push your belly out. Three, two, one, exhale. Hold your breath, no air needed. Feel your heartbeat, slow it down. Be in this moment. You're in a safe space now. Three, two, one, recovery breath in. And exhale. Feel tingly sensations and your body temperature changing, that is okay. Just feel your blood coursing through your veins. Let this love that you just cultivated spread through your whole body. All right, now we're into the breath work, guys. That was just loosening and loop. <laughs> yeah, if you feel tingly or heat, that is okay. All right, now we're into the juicy part. That was just a lubrication of our spine and our neck. Because think about it, we're, we spend a lot of our phones like this, a lot of our time like this on our phones. 
that tech snack, that's imbalance. That's imbalance. Like, your neck is like this. <laughs> so, for this breathwork session today, we're going to be tucking our chin in a lot. So, you see how we, our normal, normal spine is like this? Since we tech so much, today we're going to be chin at a neutral position, tucking it. So we're tucking in our chin today, and I'm going to be teaching two different breathwork styles. <laughs> yeah, All right. I'm going to be teaching two breathwork styles today, a three-part breath, a three-part exhale, and I call it just breathing in threes, or we can and expand this Three breath process expands to three, six, and nine. And if anyone heard of Nikola Tesla and other and other huge inventors and scientists, they they figured out the powers of three, six, and nine. And this is the basics of it. For the three work breath work session, it's gonna be a one inhale through your nose and the three part exhale out your mouth or nose, whatever one you choose. <sighs> I like using my nose, so this is how it looks. So inhale, out in threes. You inhale one deep breath, you exhale in threes. And as soon as you get to that third breath, you get right back to that inhale. So we're gonna be breathing in threes. So take one deep breath in, exhale in threes. If anybody has any questions, let's ask them right now before we start. Getting interference. Anyone else getting interference? They know. All right, hopefully that changes for you, Jane. So we're gonna be breathing in threes. So wiggle your toes. Let's wiggle our, our toes real quick if you've been in cross-legged like I have been. And you can also lay on your back for this breath work. Do not have to sit up. Sitting up is a little bit more advanced and I understand that. So if you feel like you get more relaxed laying down or you're or laying down like this. If this makes you feel more relaxed, like this, then lay down like that. If you feel like laying down when you're flat on your back, that's good too. If you want to stay in the cross leg position, if, if you're good with that, that's we can continue and we can rock on right now. So we are going to be breathing in threes, exhaling in threes. And we're going to do that for a good amount of time. Exhaling in threes. Okay. We're going to be exhaling in threes. So one inhale, exhaling in threes. All right, let's practice all together before we start. Inhale, exhale in threes. Inhale. Exhale in threes. Inhale. Exhale in threes. All right. Try one more time. Inhale. Exhale in threes. All right. Now we're going to be going a little bit deeper than we usually go today. So let's go deeper into our, within ourselves and illuminate everything that needs to be illuminated because it starts within. I only can show you different techniques and different styles. It has to be you that want to go within. All right, we're gonna start our threes and 
three, two, one. Let's begin our three breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Fill up. Exhale. Make sure you're counting threes on your exhales. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Keep it going. <laughs> Inhale. Fill it up, your belly and your chest. Inhale. Keep going. Inhale, exhale in threes. Inhale. Exhale. 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 Keep going. Exhale. Halfway there. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Three part breath. Inhale. Exhale in threes. Keep going. Keep it circular. Connecting your breath. Your inhale merges with your exhale. Inhale. Exhale in threes. Keep going. Last ten. Let's give it all we got. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale in threes. Inhale. Exhale in threes. Inhale. Exhale in threes. 
Inhale. Exhale in three. Last four. Inhale. Three more to go. Two more. Two more. Last one. Deep breath in. Exhales in three. Now stop. Hold your breath. Tuck your chin. Feel. Become aware of your body. Feel the sensation. If you feel tingly or your body temperature changing, that's okay. You're in a safe space. Keep holding. In three, two, one, recovery breath in. And hold. Push your belly out. Push your stomach out. Keep pushing your stomach out. Hands on your heart. Keep holding your breath. And exhale. Return to your normal breathing. Hmm. Feel your fingers, wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingers. Let this peace you cultivated move around. Feel this love and peace that you. Feel this love for yourself. If there's any pain or any uncomfortability, ask it now to leave. If it doesn't leave, let's become one with it. Tell the pain or tell the uncomfortability, I love you. Place your hands on the top of your heart. Let's tell ourselves we love you. I love ourselves. Let's do it three times. Deep breath in. I love myself. Do two more. I love myself. Last one. Deep. Deeper than you've gone before. I love myself. We have one more breath session. And this is going to be a little bit more intense. This is intense enough. And you don't want to go more intense and deeper. I If you need any water or anything, I would get that. If you need your water or your tea, you should go drink it. All right. If you think this was amazing, just know you're amazing. I only showed you the technique and you the one who actually put in the work to feel. All right. 
So if you've been in cross-legged or you've been laying down, wiggle your toes, feel your knees, move your hips, move your hips, rub your knees, you've been cross-legged, rub your knees, rub your hips. Wiggle your toes, crack your fingers, crack your toes, again. Right. Now, this breath work technique is called pecking. And with pecking, we're going to be increasing our lungs and our diaphragm's capacity to take in air, take in oxygen. And also, we're gonna be pecking, reverse pecking, our body's ability to not have oxygen and still be able to function. To gradually train your body to use less oxygen and utilize the oxygen it already had. Therefore, you circulate more of your oxygen in your body and your heart rate becomes significantly lower in how fast it beat. You, you're able to control your heartbeat at a better rate. And I like to call this pecking. So we're going to be doing alkaline breathing first. And then when we get to our breath holds, we're going to be pecking. And pecking is you're gonna reach your full breath in like this. I'm gonna tell you to hold. And when I say peck, you start, you start trying to pull in more air. And then reverse pecking, I'm gonna say exhale. You're gonna hold your breath and try to push out even more air. So. Yeah, you can do you can do all with the nose if you choose. You can do it with your nose. You don't have to do it with your mouth. I'm just doing it as a demonstration. Reverse pecking could look pecking pecking can look like this. You take a full breath in. Once you reach the top of your breath, pause for one second, and you start pulling in more air. And then you exhale. And I am going to be explaining alkaline breathing again. My bad, Andy, because you're going to have to edit this. <laughs> so um, alkaline breathing is what we're going to start out with. And that's an inhale through your nose, exhale through your mouth. And that's going to look like this. So we're going to start it out with alkaline breathing, and we're going to end it off with pecking. So alkaline breathing is this. Inhale, exhale. In inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. All right, is everyone familiar with alkaline breathing now? All right. So remember, alkaline breathing is in through your nose, out through your mouth. Pecking could be either or. So when I say peck, it, if you feel comfortable, if it's easier for you to peck through your mouth on that last inhale, you can do that. If it's easier to peck through your nose. I'm going to be doing my nose because that's a little bit more harder for me to do. And I'm working, getting better at it. And when you're pecking, you're actually expanding your lungs more. Expand, your, your lungs are the angel wings of your heart. Your rib cage is the angel wings of your heart. When you're doing that, you're opening more of your rib cage. You're opening more of those dormant muscles that haven't been used. All right, let's try pecking all together one time. So let's take a deep breath in in three, two, one. Take a deep breath in. Hold it. Now let's peck. Exhale. Let's try it one more time. Let's peck one more time. I'm going to say deep breath in in three, 
two, one, take a deep breath in, peck, exhale. That is what pecking is. So we're first gonna cycle our breath with alkaline, cycling your breath, merging your inhales with your exhales. And then we're gonna be pecking towards the last bit. Pecking can be a little bit more intense. Yeah, you're long, it is a long workout. <laughs> it's for sure a long workout. And this is why I said it's gonna be a little bit more intense than what you're usually up to, because this is expanding your lungs, expanding your rib cage. It's not even so much your lungs, it's your rib cage. Our lungs naturally are able to expand. It's our rib cage from sitting so much and not being as active that get tight. And if our rib cage are tight, that means our lungs can't expand to the full capacity. It's our rib cages. All right. So let's start with alkaline breathing in through your nose, out through your mouth. I'm going to tell you when you're halfway there. And I'm going to tell you when to hold your breath. And I'm going to tell you when to start pecking. Breathing is the most efficient and easy exercise you can put into your daily practice. Very easy, very simple, but very powerful and very effective. All right, let's start with alkaline breathing in three, two, one. Alkaline breathing into your nose, out through your mouth. Keep it going. Into your nose, out through your mouth. One. Keep going. In through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. In through your nose. Out through your mouth. Keep going. No pauses between inhale and exhale. Sit up straight. Let's pick up the pace. You're halfway there. Last five, slow breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Slow your breath down. That's one. Inhale. Exhale. Two. Inhale. Exhale. Three. If you feel tingly or your body temperature changing, that's okay. You're in a safe space. Inhale. Exhale. Four. Last breath. Inhale. Exhale. Five. Take a deep breath in. 
and hold. Now start pecking. <laughs> Exhale. Feel the sensation. You're in a safe space now. Let this peace and love flow through each part of your vein. Let this become invigorated in your blood. Right now, peace and blood are circulating through your vein. Feel your heartbeat, slow it down. And just be in this moment. Return to your normal breathing. All right, keep breathing normally. No pauses in your inhale and exhale. Now we're gonna do first pecking. I'm gonna tell you to exhale in a short minute. And of in a minute, we're going to be exhaling together in our breath, pushing more air. Keep inhaling, letting your breath come one. Inhale and exhale, come one. The masculine inhale, the feminine exhale. The feminine inhale and the masculine. The yin and the yang. The two sides of the same coins. All right. Deep breath in. Now let's exhale. Push all the air out. Hold. Now push more air out. Turn to your normal. All right. Definitely a little bit harder of a breath work session. You can uncross your legs now. <clears throat> wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingers. Let the blood circulate throughout your whole body. Let this peace you cultivated run from head to toe. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, pecking is definitely interesting. Like, once you take that full breath in and then suck in more air, or definitely gets, your your lung just expands more. Like, you didn't think you could probably take in more air, but you did. It's definitely a workout. And sometimes at the breath work, an intense breath work session, you did intense energy work. Sometimes you just need to go to sleep after. <laughs> Sometimes I get some done some intense breath work and I'm just like, yeah. Well, Andy, you can um stop recording the class now too. Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> 